That's right. I just remembered I was muted. Let me redo my whole shtick. Well, 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 if it isn't me playing a game I played, I've played, i never played in my entire life, but I've always heard of. God, I did it so much better the first time around. So here we go again. Uh, this time it's Mafia. And since I got the definitive edition of all three for free years ago, <laughs> that's the version I'm playing. I've never played any of these, never seen any of these. Uh, Dan Bull has a great song for Mafia 3 that I enjoy. And that's all I know. But this is Mafia 1. I think my friend said he enjoyed them to 50 years ago when they first came out. And as you can see, this is the first time I've even clicked it since I installed it a week ago. Sure are taking your sweet time. The 2K thing looks exactly like the Radon thing. Radeon. Okay. No, just play. Why do I have to go through 1,000 things? The meaning of family. Bruno. So far there's no noise. If you don't hear anything, that's because there's no noise. <laughs> Holy shaft, that was loud. Adjust the gold rectangle to match the horizontal and vertical edges. Oh, I actually can't go beyond. Okay. Seems good. Seems fine. I agree to everything. <laughs> no. No. I don't want any part of any of this. Carcyclopedia. First off, difficulty. What's the difference between easy and classic? <laughs> Let me turn my headphones down because, good God, is this loud? Way down. Uh, sure, sure, sure. Oh, yes. Cool. That's cool. <gasps> Noir mode. Oh. Okay. I kind of have to. That looks awesome. I'm sure I can turn that off whenever. <laughs> I can adjust that later. I'll just, oops. I'll put it on whatever. I can change all this later. Shit. I meant this. What is this? Oh, a car cyclopee. I get it. are less effective. Strong aim assist. I don't like aim assist. But I also don't like artificial hardness. Uh, oh, there we go. Sure, I'll do low. Simulation and regular? The hell does that mean?
I don't know what that means. Based on an original game by Illusions. Based on an original game? Interesting. I don't think I've ever played a game based on a game before. So far, I'm liking the decision for the black and white, but then again, I love black and white. I'd like to be able to control the black and white though. If I could add a touch more contrast, that would be nice. Andrew Bongiorno. As poorly. Now this looks great. Was it an actual remake or is it just like we made it spiffier? This because this looks like they did more than just made it HD. This looks better than the uh, L.A. Noir remakes or remasters or whatever is what I'm saying. Bella Popa. Shiny cars. Are we in Chicago? When was the bean made? When was the Chicago bean built? February 2004? Was that recent? Interesting. The more you know. Hey, Tommy. Thomas Angel, Detective Norman. alone. <laughs> no self-respecting badges coming in here unless it's the health inspector. What can I get you? Ah, just the coffee. Thanks. Dip your beak. No, this looks respect. excellent. That guy looks super familiar. So, you yeah. said on the phone you might have a proposition for me. That's right. But if you're looking to set up a gravy train, you called the wrong cop. I'm not looking for any, uh, associates. Good. Because I'm on the nut. What does Can't that mean? For the coffee. But I got plenty to trade. Well, let's hear it. How long you been a dumb? Three years. Caught my teeth in Empire Bay. Well, he handed you a Morello case. Right out of the gate. That's what the paper says, ain't it? And what's it to you? Tough break. Case must be getting pretty cold by now. Or you got something might warm it up. Yeah, I might have some. And what's my end of the deal? Ask uh, want money, some sort of immunity. None of that. I got people I need to protect. Ah, families. 
always the Achilles heel, ain't it? So who you got? A sick ma or a wife and a litter of kids? Wife and daughter. No one else to watch your back, I'm guessing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Pity that. Pa always said a man needs friends if he's going to survive in this world. Yeah. Well, in my world, it's the other way around. No surprise there. Look, I can't promise anything for your family, not until I hear what you're trading. So, are you talking? Or are you just killing time before they come for you? You think I'm on the run? <laughs> oh, I know it, Tommy. Jesus, <laughs> look at you. <laughs> Surely gassed. You haven't slept for days. And your neck's got to be aching from all that looking over your shoulder you're doing. No, the way I figure it is you got someone powerful mean on your tail and they ain't giving up until you end up in the river. And you walk out that door without me, we both know you're not making it five steps. Boss, yeah, you stick around, you tell me your story, and maybe you got a shot at living long enough to walk that girl of yours down the aisle. Either way, it looks like I'm buying you a cup of coffee. Christ, I don't know how everything got so balled up. No one ever sees the hair pen until it's too late. But you didn't get handed a heater in the nursery, did you? No. I was a cab driver back in 30. I'm already loving this way more than I was enjoying Metal Gear. And I haven't even it was at the end touched the controller yet. When I first met Polly and Sam. Shit! Wilhelm Scream. Son of a bitch! Watch out! Get up, Polly! There's a taxi here! We'll be okay! Move it! Come on! That was nice he opened the door for him. <laughs> I'm doing it. Head, but you don't get to walk away. I don't want any trouble. Well, you got trouble. Drive. How the hell they know we'd be there? Oh, it's been a while since I played a driving we game. Just lose them. Uh, how many cars we got following? One for now. But there will be more. Hold tight. I'm going to try something. It's a good thing it took over for that, because I couldn't tell if that was a ramp or not. Giuliani Bridge. Oh, okay. okay. Your leg okay up there? Hurts like hell. Oh, that's why you would slow down. I don't know. It might be okay. Look how gigantic these hey, I see you listening, sidewalks are. You get to listen either. All I'm doing is taking you guys where you want to go. So do that. Oh, that must be what simulation is. Just better driving physics, which makes it harder to drive. Because okay, cars the back then suck to control. But look at, how, look at how they slide. This is nice. Tired of questions. Oh, there's a gas gauge. That's interesting. And it's really weird that the HUD is not in black and white. Come off by driving in a straight line. Oh. Right. 
Is that it? Oh, <laughs> maybe I should have put it on regular driving. <laughs> Is that, what is, oh no, this isn't GTA, I can't run through that stoplight. Yoink. Okay, I guess I have to drive into one of these arrows then. Okay, so there's no, is there a handbrake? Oh my god, that is so bright. Uh, ba 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 Let me just try driving the regular then. See if that changes anything. That was your shortcut. I lost him, didn't I? Not all of them. These guys really don't like it, do they? I'm telling it's business park. Okay, this is actually better because before, excuse me. Before I would hit the brakes to try and like drift, as though it were a handbrake, which it was not doing, it was just come to a complete stop. And now that I switched it back to regular, I can drift. Sort of. Uh oh. You wanted to get across the river. Car is very slow though, and horrible to handle, which is uh, expected. Talk it through back at the bar. Yeah, that's a much better drifting situation. Best comfort for you, Taxi Lost Heaven. <laughs> Mafia Definitive Edition Black and White HUD. Eh, just added HUD or er, Noir mode. Um, maybe uh, there are other custom HUD options. <coughs> oh, he's about to get shot! You've got to be carefully taught. If you talk, you're gonna get shot! Compensation for your services. Any damage to your car. This makes us square. Danke schön. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Silieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan, or some honest work, don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. <sighs> One more thing. This matter stays between us. Anyone asked where you got that money? We wanted it at poker. Scratches on your car. You swerved. Keep from hitting a little old lady. You got it? Yeah, of course. See you around, kid. Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. 
money was good sharp, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then, I was out. After that night with Salieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts. This game looks great. And other people's thoughts too. When you're a cabbage. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. So where, to? where to, ma'am? St. Michael's Church, directly. Careful, please. What do you mean, careful? Drive careful? Then you'd be the first. Look at these big ass streets. Tap this to turn on the speed limiter. The bitch! Don't you awooga me? Turn that racket off. I can't hear myself think. I gotta hold it. That's much better. This is cool, the speed limiter thing. So, Wait, I turned it church. off and the music's still playing. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. I'm driving carefully and respecting the law. I like the music. <laughs> I keep forgetting how bad it is to control the cars. Which again, is how it's supposed to be for these cars. Cool cathedral. Stop there. By the park. Yeah, bid. Can't you see I'm obeying the law? Skirt. Here you go, St. Michael's. That'll be thirty cents. Huh? The only tip I'll give you is to stop smoking in your vehicle. I felt like I was sitting in an ashtray. Bitch, you think I do this for sure. free? Whatever you say. You better have given me my thirty cents. Rude. Paradise up above. If you would tell me I'm the only one that you love. Life could be a dream, sure. sweetheart. Like can... Hello, hello again. Shaboom, I'd hope that we'd meet again. Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much. Just talking. I'm paying you to drive, so do that. Can't you see Look I'm respecting the law? The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving him an excuse. Oh no, it's economic downturn. Power. The work is always there. I wonder what that's like. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Saw that before the crash. So yeah, All right, I get to be busy. Depression. Your busy day's gonna be looking at old paintings. I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Oh, there's Tell a time limit? Driving quit bothering me. Yeah, yeah, I get you. Oi, what was that about? Is there a map? 50 seconds to get. Holy cow! This place is huge! 
I might have to kick it into sport mode here for a second, my guy. On the double. It is weird. What the hell are you doing? It is weird that there's a time limit. I thought that was an actual sign, so I swerved to swerve for it. Thanks, pal. Here's 50 cents. Mm. Spend it all at once. Thank you. <clears throat> Damn. First day and already yeah, almost made a dollar. A son of a bitch. All both of them. Under the next. Where to, boss? Oh boy, you look like shit. <laughs> I've been working since five. What's your excuse? Most the figures. <laughs> Where are we going? Little Italy. I just came from second. there. Okay. If I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the limit. Good deal. Great deal. Got any good fares today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Ain't that the truth? Money for cab rides since the market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I'm drunk and don't know better. Cops see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Yeah, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use it. Any excuse. <laughs> this city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. Also gotta remember... The, uh... Prohibition. So that's... Good to keep in your brain case. Swift Cola. Wait, why was that guy... Why did I have a time limit on the last one, but not this one? Oh, now we're getting slow down. Pardon me, trolley. Nearly there. It's up here on, on the corner, please. Hey, my cousin has a coffee stand around the corner. Tell him Lucio sent you. Take a break, huh? Thanks. Might just do that. You just took the whole cup? Oh, Jesus. Oh. Hey, how you doing, pal? You remember me? No. Yeah? Dinosaur? Is that Paul F. Tompkins? Huh? Oh. Mr. Morello's a little bent. Shouldn't go help in Salieri's goons, huh? Nah, he's bigger than Paul. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't lose much locking for a while. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. Please tell me I don't have to keep hitting the A button. Oh, thank God. It's not Rockstar Rules. Yeah, run. Forget the trash can. I like the music going on with this. Oh, do I have to hold it? No, I was pressing it. Oh yeah, okay, so it's a toggle, not a... How are they keeping up with me? I'm handsome. He's still a very weighty gentleman. Controls aren't as tight as. Well, they're still tighter than a Rockstar game. <laughs> Look at 
like this. Locksmith. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou. You got business with the Don? Nah, we just... Just openly brandishing a pistol. <laughs> that right. Yeah. What is he is the Don's favorite driver? So anything you gotta say to him, you can say to me. That right. Well, I'll tell you something, pal. We ain't leaving empty handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. <laughs> to openly brandishing a shotgun. <laughs> say that. See your boys around. Go, Lou. <laughs> Thanks. At least we could do. Come on. Let's go say hi to the Don. Don Silieri? Yeah. He's going to want to hear about this. This looks so good in black and white, man. I expected someone older. I thought that old guy was the Don. And then I was like, damn, he actually gets to shake the Where Don's hand? Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Frank told me you ran into some trouble? Yes, sir. My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him by the kind of Tommy help us. <laughs> this, uh, taxi. That's your livelihood? Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility. So I'm going to set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab of yours fixed up. Well, I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? <laughs> I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cab. <laughs> you hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas girls hang out at a bar of yours. Paul, you know the place. Sure do, boss. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. Go smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hard-working Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. And Tom, when you get back, we'll talk about what's next. No one else knows you here, so tread careful. No one else knows you here. Boss finished yet? All right, give me fifty-seven seconds while I get more ice. Standing, oh my headphones. Standing is the opposite of sitting. Standing is the opposite of running around. Excuse me, Maya. Doggy. Uh, headphones on. She said she wanna be with my uniform on. She grabbed me by the bed. Now she's gone, 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 gone. I never finished sex because I'm so juiced out. But she nodded three times and we bashed and I bounced. Who's the new guy? The name's Bingus. Okay, I am actually losing. Uh, 
goodies. First off, depth of field I'm not even seeing. Let's just go mediums. Right ho. Second. Let's go minimal. <sighs> yeah, there doesn't seem to be a black and white option for the HUD. Which is interesting, because you would... Well, I guess I get it. And thirdly... Let me come over here and I'm going to open up Discrod in case any friendlets want to join. Give it a sextant. Give it a sextant. Oh. Streaming. That seems fine. This seems fine. That seems fine. Open up the game and eat some lines. Why does it look grainier? Is it the depth of field? That can't be right. Weird. Maybe it was always grainy, and I just straight up didn't recognize. Uh, okay, can't run indoors. Fair. Anyways, I got places to be. Okay, come through this way. I'll take you to Vinny first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go see him whenever we need to do any uh, heavy lifting. Make sure we're well healed for when there's trouble. I realize why it's a bad idea to have a minimal hut on. It's so weird to see people that are fully clean shaven and don't look like children. I guess it's the cigarettes. Oh, I got just a thing. This classic should do the trick. Put that in my pocket. The bat don't work out for use. I got a few cocktails here. Careful with them, though. Wanna burn off your short ears? <laughs> Good to meet you, Todd. Let me know if Paulie gives you the hard time. I'll straighten him out. If Paulie gives you the hard time. Oh, ma 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 mia. He's a special kind of idiot. He's got a way with cars. So, like, sexiness aside, I think pinups are very cool to look at, art wise. I never understood how artists can get that kind of sort of like airbrushed but still colored pencil-y kind of feeling. I should look into that. Can't just sneak up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Ralphie. I've been busting your balls. <laughs> Why does there always seem to be so some stutterer? Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> we ain't nothing alike. You 
got that, Ralph. Rude. You can actually tell his hat is made of wool. That is awesome. Good to meet you. Or a beaver fur. Like, it doesn't look like a game hat. It looks like a hat. A little bit of rust, but that's okay. Don't let me catch you Dirt don't hurt. Again. Loafing off. <laughs> One day I'm gonna cut your brake line, asshole. <laughs> I don't know what Ralph's trying to pull giving us this motor. I want to show you something about the good life and you're driving something my mom could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken out of our yard. Yeah, the car's fine. It's good to get a change from the cab. You don't have to be nice about it. Spins a tin can! So, was that whiskey back there in the truck? Yeah. New supplier. You guys deal in broad daylight? Normally, nah. This was their first drop off. And the cops know better than to come sniffing around our turf. You actually lose oh, a ton of acceleration when you just let off the George. gas instead of just hitting the brakes like it tells you to. We're okay. As long as we're careful. An eye Whoa. over our shoulder. Whoa. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through. You want a bottle? Just ask. Keep some back for friends. Ah, I'm Someone's no big discording something. I used to tip back bathtub gin most days, but not so much now. That stuff's no good for you. You don't have to go blind now, though. For us, you got a line in the good stuff. Well, that's good of you. Thanks. Not just the booze we supply, Tom. It's the places we deliver to. The dames they got in these places. Best tables, best food, best skirt. Some way to live. Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day. Let's see what it looks like in color. Uh. You're the bastard. Oh, good oh pretty sky. Sure, sure. Besides, all this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble says the guy is about to set fire to Morello's parking lot. <laughs> I got. I like the noir better. You to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine, it's a nice not to let him see your dreary face. day. <laughs> Either that, or you hit him so hard they don't remember it. I wonder if you can flip your car, because it certainly feels like you can. Oh, motorcycle. There's some kind of line between his streets and Celieri streets. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work North Park. And more besides. You're walking on the wrong sidewalk, in the wrong part of town, you start getting a sense you need to be someplace else. You can feel it long before they start appearing on street corners to stare you down. Okay, it's close by. Park in this glowing parking space. Morello's goons smoke and jaw up front and leave their motors out back. Big break so tobacco. Put some gorilla on guard duty, but it's always some no name schmuck. Come on, over here. You gotta sneak in and wreck the cars. And a message. Sure. Why are you coming with? See if you get shot. Dino? 
Let's get big cards. Take your bat and start swinging. LB. Why bother with the bat? That's gonna make noise. Just throw cocktails at him. That guy's dead. Come on, Tom, quick. There's gonna be more of them. Use a Molotov. And... Oops. <laughs> that was a funny animation. Does that count for both of them? Oh, yeah, there we go. You know this is Dino's car. I don't like you, and you got a good car. I'm gonna know where you. Reports of burning vehicles and gunfire in North Park. Detroit and Morello's place. Don't bring in the wrong people. Why would the police automatically know this? We gotta get out of here before the bulls. Later, boyos. Definitely killed that guy. Sorry, ma'am. Right now they're pissed. But let's not get them real pissed. So I don't understand the hold A to bash cars? Like, what is that doing? Is it giving me extra speed? Because I'm hitting it now and it's... I guess it does give me a... Well, maybe it's not giving me a little boost. Oh, that was fast. There's a cop right behind me. I thought Cilieri had cops on the books. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. How did it feel? Feel good? How'd what feel? Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it did. There's no time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. You think it's for you? This life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beef motors in parking lots. Eh. There's busy days, there's slow days. I've had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, still enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, knew never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by and I'm still there. So, I got a suit now and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I always thought that to be in a family you had to have more connections. Your brother or your uncle. Or... Oh, some guys, sure. Your cousin got made, or you like Carlo, whose pop went way back with the Don. That means you get trusted more when you're starting out. There's plenty of us who came in off the street. I'm thinking we get you in front of the boss, then we tip a few. Well, I don't got plans, so... Sure you don't got plans. The plans are to feed Vinny so much booze that Luigi has to roll him out the door again. I'm good with whatever. <laughs> sure you are. Loaded dry. What happened to the car I sent you out with? Dumped it. It got better.
No registration needed, I guess. What the fuck was that? You just teleported into me. He's still with you then. Somehow. Yeah. Hey boss. It's done. No trouble? Uh, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not going to be able to think straight for weeks. See, that's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morello is a hothead. And all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. Got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. This guy sounds like a Canadian you know, trying to do Make sure the bills get an Italian-American mafioso voice. It'd be an honor, sir. Good. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you. But you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen. Around here. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. Second, we don't deal in the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Finally. That guy's clearly got a cops. dope ring. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Salieri. Then I'm going to only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. A lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. So he is an artist with the numbers. Artist with numbers. All these guys. In this room... What on earth could they possibly be talking about? The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know Stop what that is, fucking talking. Not the people in the game, my friends. <laughs> They're loyal. That's right. Now you stay straight with me, you're going to be living the high life now. But you abuse my trust. Don Salieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. He kind of looks like Patton yeah. Oswalt there. <laughs> Welcome to the family. Excellent. Now I'm starving. Luigi, let's eat. Welcome. A barman Luigi is not much of a cook. But his daughter Sarah. Mark Marin. Mark Marone. Ornuri. First days in Celieri's bar were slow. I moved crates and delivered messages. The guys busted balls and told stories from the old country. Mostly, we just waited. I got to thinking, maybe life in Cilieri's crew wasn't gonna get me clipped. <laughs> but what did I know? You Tommy? Yeah. Boss is waiting for you. Thanks. The hell is this outfit? This is terrible. Sorry, I'm late. Take a seat. That's collection day, boys. So, Tommy, you'll drive. Paulie and Sam can handle the rest. It'll be routine. Just a handful of stops today. Bill at the motel was a little short last month. We'll make sure he pays us the interest he owes. No problem, boss. 
Don't lay hands on anyone unless there's no other choice. Our clients need to understand that we provide a valuable service. They need to look at you and see Santa Michael. They need to believe you'll protect them. So let Morella stoop to breaking legs. We're better than that. But the bill's still due, and everyone pays up. We can handle it. Go see Ralphie about a car. Okay, boss. Ah, Vinny said to say he's got something for you, Tom. Head to him first. Probably just wants to tell you some bullshit story about some guy he whacked 20 years ago. <laughs> and he's a weaponsmith? Vincenzo Lorini? Hey! I saw Forget this. about it. And I thought of you. A tiny <laughs> Derringer. <laughs> you ever carry a rat? Shot him at the fair a couple of times. <laughs> right. That don't count. Pointed at the target over there. <sighs> you passed. the walls okay now show me your reload I open the chamber and away you go how the fuck All right. I Last thing. had the app Please open for so long and the instant I turn the app off they start talking again sorry my boy what were you saying good to go and when shooting starts get behind some and don't shoot yourself Thanks, Vincenzo. I appreciate it. Hey, the Frank and the boss, Vincenzo. For you. It's Vinny. Dime detective. Can I look at those? Death wears red heels. A Bill Brent novelette. Calamity Lou. A Mr. Maddox story. Oh, it's not actual. See, how do you get this kind of art style? Is it just from a printer? Is that why it looks cool? Or is it like actually from like colored pencils and stuff? Okay, I'll mute myself. Fans call you out on collections, huh? Shaking guys down. Any time of the week, any time of the day, who knows how much the whole damn city owes us. It all goes in the book. Gotcha. All right. You guys need to be careful for that, okay? I spoke to Biff. He said Morello's still bent since he lost the cars. Ah, what's losing some motors to him? He's got at least five garages this side of town. He's not wrong, Paul. You guys know it like I know. It's always the same. Bello does this, so Salieri does that. Some cars here, some booze there. Just calm down for a few weeks, then it all happens again. The world keeps turning. Well, it's been a month. A month's made of weeks. Quit whining. Ralphie, what do you got for me, babe? One year since the crash. The worst panic in Wall Street's peacetime history was one year ago today and still no escape of the wider economic depression that has followed it. Unemployment reached 8% this month. Jeez. But given the prevailing trend of shuttering businesses, banks, and foreclosed farmsteads, some economists warn that this could double, perhaps even triple in coming years. Special picture featuring show scenes from every state. Here, Ralph. You, you, you know how to get, get into one of these, Tommy? Elbow goes through. Touch <laughs> inside. Easy. And an afternoon to f f fix the window back up. Watch. And. Water. You're a regular 
magician, bro. Hold to pick a car lock. Show me what's okay. It's pick a car. You got it. Have a good day, Papa Bella. There's no gas. It won't start. Even though it's full of gas. First we got Al. He runs a bakery on Longman Street. You know it? Yeah, I know it. Al's late again? Seems so. Eh, that's too bad. Where's the exit? Dino's got to be pissed we're driving around in his wagon. The fall off camera for the car is very wobbly. Which is cool for chase scenes, but kind of sickening. Brace ya. Honk. Okay, this is it. Watch what we do today, Tom. When it goes smooth, it's a breeze. When they put up a fight, sometimes you gotta think on your feet. Sure. Just follow my lead. I hate this outfit. <laughs> but I'm loving those cinnamon rolls. How are you? We're good. How's little Julia? Ha! So little now. She's turning into a painted. This letter is a notification that you are in default of your obligation to make payments on your agreed loan. This amount has been overdue since July 15th, 1930. You have ignored requests to pay this debt. Unless the full amount is received within two weeks, I will have no choice but to instruct this bank to begin the foreclosure process on your <coughs> home and business. <coughs> Grand Imperial Bank Manager Christopher Marcino. October 15th, so he's been default for four or five months. Like a grandma. That's good to hear, Al. Real good. <laughs> now you got any trouble around here? cake. Any punks causing problems? No, no. Nothing like that. Good. So you got the money. I got it uh, waiting in the back room. Oh, Tommy will get it. You stay here where we can see you. It's been real slow this month, Sam. I was worried I wouldn't have enough. Al, I know you'd never hold out on us, but it's good you worry. I mean, how can we protect you? Hey, little mama. That's the back of the shop, Tom. Cigarette cards. Oh, good. Dog noises. the money. Veron, fetcha! Noi ci succhiate il sangue! It's on the table, brown envelope! I speak very little Italian, by which I mean zero, but I know you said something about blood. Vieni qui! Lasciate ci in pace! Requiescat in pace to you too. She probably said something along the lines of "Leave us in peace." Let us know if you need anything. Anything at all. Sure will, Sam. Sure will. Hey, give our best to your mom. Huh? How much do you charge for a triangle? Schubert. Okay, next up we got old Eugene's place. China store up on Tallow. He's not dead yet? <laughs> Almost. Heard his nephew's taking over. 
guy who used to run this next place, Tom? His name's not Eugene. Guy's a Chinaman. But it sounds like Eugene. Well, that's what we called him. Polly slammed Racist. his head into the counter back in... Jesus. 27, I think. <laughs> yeah, it was hilarious. After that, no problems at all. If you look, you can still see the blood. Poor old bastard couldn't scrub it out. We keep some of these guys on our books to remind the Chinatown gangs they're in our city. Not My cars. So he might need reminded too. I have a hard time believing cars of this era could get up a hill that steep. I mean, obviously they could, but still. This is it. I'll cover this one, Sam. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. It's not letting me out. On his own. Yeah, when Polly's built up a little steam, he needs to let it out on his own. She's got to let him get on with it. It's his way. He's gonna end in disaster. His voice. Gotta let him lone wolf from time to time. Keeps him happy. Oh shit. Yep. Always when I remember I have freedoms. He's going. Polly don't stop. Once we were putting a squeeze on this tailor over in Holbrook, guy ended up in a wheelchair. Here he comes. He's a fast worker. I definitely uh, wasn't any Fritos. Next stop's Bill at the motel. Eugene's nephew's guy's money is ours next week with some extra besides. He doing okay? He's okay. How's the shop counter? Yeah, that's seeing some more blood. <laughs> How much blood? And nothing he can't scrub out. Once he's back on his feet. Seems like you didn't even give him a chance, though. Get to hear even more about Chinese nephew guys scrubbing their own blood out of shop counters. Yeah, seems like it's not too hard. Not hard. Kind of not hard. I don't know. Comes natural to you guys. Don't see why it can't come natural to me. So anyone could do this. Me and Polly, we've been working these streets for years. You come in and you think you know it all. Of course, that's how this guy acts. You've been a day on the job, pal. You haven't seen what we do. You haven't seen how we do it. Sam, I think you ought to... No, Polly. This punk thinks he can walk in here like a big shot. I put greasers like him in the ground. I think you gotta say you're sorry, Tom. Sorry, huh? Well, I'd say sorry if I couldn't see the bullshit smile you're trying to hide. <laughs> you got him, though, Sam! You got him! <laughs> I could smell the crap in your <laughs> pants from here. Nah, you didn't get me. <laughs> When little Tony first came out with us, I had him on his knees before he knew I was yanking his chain. <laughs> yeah, you did better than him anyways. Jesus, I hate it out of the city. You hate it most places. Yeah, but out here it's worse. How come there's a place so far out of town on our books? Out of town's the safest place for deals. Safest place for card games. The safest place for most of the things we do. We're expecting a big bag of money today. The guy owes. If it ain't big, the boss will be pissed. Yeah, this place is a real earner. Oftentimes, the places that get you the most dough are the ones most people don't look at twice. Just recently, the motels had a new lease of life. Last stop before Lost Heaven for rum coming up from Cuba. They drive it this far? Sure they do. 
And that's how we can sell oh, it so expensive. Bill's motel has gotten to be the place where crates get exchanged. Bitch. Well, Gary protects it, but he lets the other families use it too. Even Morello? To keep the peace? Oh sure. god, the cops. Plus, it's far enough away that no one cares. So long as everyone's making money, Officer, no one's gonna rock the beat. No we, we got some heat, Tom! Why did that happen? There are no cops around to have seen that. Hold <laughs> on. Hmm. What the hell is this? Is this a shotgun? Get these cops off our asses! They are even on us. Good work. Get him next time. So long as everyone's making money, no one's gonna rock the boat. No, I wondered why did that do that? Streets and sidewalks. You not one for the great outdoors, Polly? He's not one for anything. Indoors, outdoors, in the city, out of the city. No, why are they fucking... We got I hit the button... ...to open up the weapon wheel so I could holster the gun. And that shot three times. And even though there are no people around, I still called the cops. Get these flatfoot bastards off of... Okay, no sign of the cops. There it is. Good work. Wait for us here, Tom. We'll be back in a bit. Oh, okay. Eating Fritos, allegedly. Ow. From here on out, this place is ours. Capiche? And don't come back, or you'll end up in worse shape than your friends. <sighs> get Sam. They're trying to beat information out. I gotta get you to a doctor. No, I thought Sammy was dead. I can wait. Get Sam out of there. Okay. Okay, just hang on. Knock knock. Nothing doing. Use the fucking lockpick. Oh, that's weird. If I had my. Wait, what? If I had my. F oh, wait. If I had the fist out and then I hit square to fist and it didn't work, so I hit LT to aim my fist and that also didn't work, it pulled out the gun. Damn, is he in the room or up downstairs? Hey, 
Why is it? It's not hitting. How do you fucking use the bat? It's not with X or. It's not letting me use the bat with X or RT. Gentleful father and husband. Oh, people. Oh, look at the bear. Ooh, it's hard to see with the noir mode. That's cool. This is the contrast I was after. White whites and black blacks. once. What does it take cover button? A? Yes. Imagine whatever happens to Sammy as a uh, cutscene thing and not a uh, timed thing. Otherwise, there would be a timer. I could use more health, please. Swap service pistol. Wait, that's less. Wait, service revolver. It's service. Service revolver. Pocket revolver. Service revolver is louder and longer. Front door. Sam, I really went to work on you, buddy. Come on, you'll be all right. You're tough as nails. Jeez. Oh, shit. Oh, he's got the money, Tom. Oh, catch the bastard. Where is Sam? He's okay. Inside. Then go get the money. Let me just turn on my speed limiter. Do I want it? Oh, luckily my revolver has infinite shots. Imagine this isn't actually hurting the car.
How about I exit the vehicle if I have full health in here? What I saw the cost. What it meant to be on the inside. I should have took off there and then. But I couldn't go back to being a nobody. That's how they get you, baby. Ow. It's a mess, though. So that's how a regular polluter goes from cabby to mob enforcer overnight, is it? Just dumb luck. Didn't feel that way at the time. Me parking on that particular street, taking a break just when Polly and Sam were coming around the corner with the ads. It felt like, I don't know, like someone was watching out for us. <laughs> Whatever helps you sleep at night, pal, but it's a lucky break all the same. I mean, one day you're busting your back, doing an honest day's work in a city that's been trying to scrape you off its heels since the day you stepped off the boat. And the next you're stuffing your pockets full what? of Salieri's dirty money. That's, and Lord and Dover, that's right, not Mel Gear Solid. Nope, it's my boy Mafia One. Oh my god, is that the Tommy Spumoni? Uh, his name's Tommy, I don't know his last name. <laughs> Salieri? Salieri's the Domarello? boss. So who's the Don? Don Morello. Don, Don Morello's the bad guy so far. Oh my god. Don Salieri. Don is the bad guy? No, to who's Tony? That's the guy. The guitarist for Raging Against the Machine. Oh no. Don Morello, that's the name. <laughs> we are here at I'm playing in noir mode. I can see that. He's <laughs> looking rather old, except for the... Uh, Oh, I think it looks great. They whatever they it did for these, fantastic. yeah, whatever they but, did for these remakes, are incredible. They need, to, they need to add a little bit of uh, film grain, a little bit of <laughs> you know, some, like uh, whatever they call the little tears that happen on the film. That and also falls under to, film grain. <laughs> yeah, they need to lower the FPS to twenty four, and then we're talking <laughs> and make it in uh, four eighty p at most. Oh, that one I think I can change. I was driving real fast. Yeah, the 4x3 aspect. Yeah. What you're saying is my fault. No, 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 no. Joey Crackers. Joey Crackers. That's what you get for having a name Joey Crackers. Well, repairs are going to be expensive. So try to tell him. <laughs> oh, no! He's going to iron his tire. Oh, my God. That's not a car. That's a human man. <laughs> I'm just watching. Yeah, I'm really not, nothing to see here, folks. <laughs> no, why are they walking away? Are they scared of him? <laughs> is that is that Tom Morello? I have no idea. <laughs> I was paying <laughs> little attention. Does this game have gameplay? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's like it's like GTA, but it's only eighty percent cutscenes. <laughs> I, I heard. Now I don't know if this is true, but when the game first came out. Um, or rather the remake, people were like, oh, you're basically on rails when you're in the car? Uh, I mean, you can control where the car goes, but so far, like, 99% of the time you've been in a car has been, like, followed this guy, so. But the map is pretty huge. Mm. But I've never, really is. I've never played or heard anything about these games before, but I got the, like, Trilogy remake for free like two or three years ago or something. So I figured give it a shot, and I'm enjoying it so Dude, far. Out of Mafia Two, Mafia Two was fun back in the day. <laughs> I don't think it holds up, but so far this first one is pretty good. At least yeah, story like the first one a lot. People hate the third one. That's interesting because that's the one I want to play the most. <laughs> It is the newest, which means it probably has the most promise, but people are I, really mad. I just think New Orleans would be fun to be in. Well, you just play Red Dead 2. See, that's Better fair, but I put Orleans, 50 hours in Red Dead 2 and probably got like six chapters in out of 900. <laughs> yeah. It was a fucking long game. Yeah. Yeah. That's the guy. He's a good kid, but a bit of a scrapper. Not too smart. But... With Really good. A few years mm -hmm. ago, Mike, he comes to me I agree. For a loan. I've to get never been. So he can keep Honestly, Rockstar hard. games are weird because I, I feel like the only reason I ever liked them in the past, like from 
GTA San Andreas all the way up until like Red Dead 1 was just like they had kooky characters uh, the writing was funny and the gameplay was cool because of the physics engine but beyond that it wasn't that like great and they've kept the exact same gameplay for the last 20 years oh yeah see the only thing they've stepped up is their actual storytelling see the I've been playing Rockstar games since GTA 3, and by playing Rockstar games, I mean I played 3, San Andreas, uh, whatever the other one was around that time, Vice City, yeah, and uh, 5, and a bit of Red Dead 2, and while they are all exactly the same game, I did not interact with the story at all in any of them. <laughs> yeah. Just walk in and murder people. And that's all. I, I didn't either, except for Dead 2, because it actually yeah. like, makes made you. The story feel. It, it makes the story feel unavoidable, but not in a bad way. Yeah, exactly. I agree. Like, in, in, in uh, GTA 5, I was always like, okay, well, I'm this character, now I'm just going to flip me over to this character. Yeah. I forgot what this guy was even doing, so I don't care. I'll just go to his mission marker. This guy and has a special driving play. move. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this guy's a good driver for whatever reason. This guy's really <laughs> fucking good at shooting for whatever reason, and this guy's good at being insane. Yeah. <clears throat> Now, but, I didn't pay attention to literally anything that just happened in any of those classes. Uh, so Tom Morello is going to play a shredding solo mm -hmm. on your wife if you don't go Not my pay wife. Him respect. Yeah, uh, on this, the day of his daughter's wedding. I don't so. even think I've met my wife yet. <laughs> oh, there he is. This old That's man. Pauly. Old that, man. That McGee. man, Pauly, is your wife. <laughs> Pauly. I like a good mafia story. Hey, Titi Tommy, big day coming up, right? right? I have seen, you seen your uh, race before? Uh, kind of hard to miss. Godfather so 1. And while I recognize it was a good movie, the shit was way too long. Babe, I have the exact, exact feelings toward it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like, we just watched it probably last year or something, me for the first time, and I was like, this is fine, it's perfectly fine, I get why people like it a lot, but at the same time, it does not need to be five hours long. Honestly, I hate the trend nowadays. Mm -hmm. Like, put a hard cap, two and a half hours, the movie's long, longer than that, yeah. it, it's over. Mm -hmm. My ass hurts, my back hurts, and that's all I'm thinking about. <laughs> or at least have like a stretch break. Yeah, an intermission. Yeah. Yeah, whatever having an intermission. I could go sit down for a five-hour play if I had an intermission in the middle. <laughs> could go to the lobby and try to coerce the bartender. It's a call. There, there was a recent play that literally, if you're going to see it, it literally takes eight hours to see. I forget what it's called, though. Oh my god. Hamilton, because it feels like it. No, Hamilton's only two hours, 40 minutes. <laughs> and yet, somehow, the soundtrack is 20 hours. How does no, that work? No, it's only two hours, 40 minutes. <laughs> The okay, whole thing is okay. the whole thing is done in song, which is why I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I love a good Hamilton. I just remember I was driving from Charlotte to Raleigh, it was about two and a half hours the way I went, and I listened to the whole fucking thing. That's how I, I made like... Nick listen to it when he was driving me from Charlotte to Raleigh. <laughs> <laughs> so long. Good stuff, good, in though. my opinion. Yeah. I still don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna go meet with the guard at the racetrack for some reason. <laughs> Do you think people did like drag races in these kind of cars? They did. That's what hot rod. That's where hot rods came from. They would fuck up their cars so that they would get the best speed or the best handling or the best whatever. And it was like, a, it was with a, that chassis. Yeah, it was all these. Well, they would take these early '30s and '20s yeah. Fords, and then they would like. They chop the roof. chop them. They'd uh, shorten parts of the chassis. They'd cut out the floors and then put little baskets for their feet to fit in because it saved weight and stuff. And they did all kinds of mods. Fucking Flintstone shit. Yeah, <laughs> just run across the ground to get extra two miles an hour. Uh, one of the channels I watch on YouTube is this guy who restores old Fords, but he restores them in the way that they were. It's screwed up to be hot rods, and it's really it's really interesting. Any friend of Ralphie's a friend of mine. You got the money, sure. And you'll see, <clears throat> you'll see like 
Model T's from 1914 that they like put in gigantic engines and then like cut the chassis in half and welded it back together and like it's crazy these mods these people in the 50s used to do I like I like the idea of getting like a little sports car a muscle car and mm -hmm. just putting an engine that's so big it just sticks out like four feet above the hood and you just can't see when you're driving. People do that. That's, exactly. <laughs> that's my shit. <laughs> I love it. I don't like seeing. I like seeing the engine. <laughs> Hello, guard. I don't know why we're here, but I'm here. It's weird that the noir mode doesn't turn, I was about to say, turn the HUD black the and white. <laughs> oh, God, I'm seeing yellow. What's happening? Here she is. The only option I... Yep, see? Whoa. Oh, it's gorgeous. That's a fucking Pinewood Derby car. This is, if I'm not mistaken, based off of a... Oh, what's it called? It's a... the original Indy cars. It's a 1926... Fuck, I really, really loved this car way back in the day. Let me see if I can look it up. It's like an old... It's like one of the first BMWs. 1926 BMW Roadster? Something like that. Oh, I'm just getting, uh, motorcycles. Uh. But it is, it is something like that. It's like one of the first, uh, well, not first, but like a very, very early style, like Ferrari or something like that. Mercedes, they're really cool. I thought there's room for one and a half passengers. And if I'm not mistaken, if I turn on color mode. The, the, like, iconic version of this car is, like, this baby blue color. So let's see what it says it is. Nope. I'm gonna guess, uh... Wooden. <laughs> Wood <Brown. laughs> wooden colored. <laughs> just brown. Blue. Right there, baby oh, blue. No! <laughs> <laughs> yep. The there iconic is. version is this baby blue color. <laughs> I think you're just reverse colorblind. Yeah, well, <laughs> sure. You saw, you saw it before you changed it. Yeah, I am an artist. <laughs> Well, You're like, I know that shade of gray. Yeah. That's maybe blue gray. <laughs> oh, this is so much faster than any other car in the game so far. Oh, ah! God. <laughs> And you're dead. Yeah. And you're dead. There's this cool thing this game does, which I've never seen in any other game, where if I hit select, it puts a speed limiter on, so I can't go faster oh. than whatever it says. Which that is, must be the on rails thing I was thinking of. It's really cool. But if I take it off. It's like switching into sport mode. Oh my god, it's so fast. <laughs> the handling is so terrible. <laughs> oh god, I didn't realize there was a time limit. <laughs> Some, Simpsons hit and run shit. It's so fast. This is 1930. <laughs> you, you just fucking Great Gatsby the shit out of him. Yep. <laughs> That's not nice. <laughs> that was on purpose. Yeah. <laughs> that guy saw me coming. Mm -hmm. Unless, of course... Nope, my headlights are gone. <laughs> Whoa, why is the thing way over there if it's telling me to go this way? Visual angles or something? <laughs> God, it's gonna murder my brain to no end to not remember who made this car. I just remember it's like a 1920s Roadster. And I feel mm, like it's Harris, 1926. Harrison Ford. Her yes, a 1926 Harrison Ford Roadster. That's right. A 1926 Ford versus Ferrari Roadster. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gran Turismo 4 PS2 Roadster. Damn it. Who was it? I don't know, so I never saw it. Mad Pitt, <laughs> Matt Damon? Damon? Yeah, something like that. There's a few people that are just the same person, but it's like <laughs> uglier. Matt Damon's one of them. Uh, what is it? Ford vs. Ferrari. 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 It was Christian Bale and Matt Damon. Christian Bale? <clears throat> Christian Bale. Not a single scratch was had. <laughs> I've always wanted one of these cars, too. And they're, well, some of them are powered by, like, a jet engine. 
because back in the day, all those companies like Ferrari and Mercedes and stuff, they would they started out making tractor and airplanes. Uh, tractor planes. <laughs> and then crazy to, when planes well, came like at the same time as like actual automobiles. Actually, before a little bit. A little after, actually. Uh, wait, no. When was Kitty Hawk? Uh, Kitty Hawk was 1903. 1903. Was like 1906. Well, first, or like the that. first cars, if you count like early, early, early automobiles, is like 18, yeah, 1880 uh, something. But they were like fucking steam engines. Yeah, 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 or something. yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. But yeah, Ford was early 19s. But once. I mean, to be fair, yeah, airplanes <laughs> weren't commercialized until like World War One. Yeah, which is. That was by necessity, because it's like, uh oh, gigantic war, we control the skies New now. War. The greatest war. <laughs> no need for a second one. Okay. Drive careful. Why? I, I've never understood why there are time limits. Oh, I'm testing the engine or something? What's going yeah, on? Yeah, like. You're, you're, uh, trying not you're to overheat the engine, or maybe you're trying to overheat. Oh my God, Swift Cola. Yeah. <laughs> Does that mean me reload faster? Okay, I what assume that flash. Uh, it's called Lost Heaven, but I assume it's just Chicago. Chicago makes sense. The handling is actually worse now that he's upgraded the engine or whatever he did. Because <laughs> I can just not put any input in it, but the car just jerks to whichever side it wants to. <laughs> Which it was not doing before. Also, I'm getting a hot 30 frames a second. Oh, now it's 23. <laughs> yeah. Now it's more accurate. <laughs> Yeah, the handling is way worse than it was. I don't know what's going on now. It's not responding to the stick pretty much at all. Yeah, you need my truck sim treatment. Yeah, where I all oh, I overheated it because I forgot that was part of this thing. But it slowed <laughs> me down enough that the cops won't take me in because I'm passing a cop right now. <laughs> uh, I see it, but I don't believe it. No, that's oh, not fair. That's you. You stole that car. Why? You stole that car. I didn't and then you steal hit that it. Car. Someone else stole it. The car was stolen when I found it. <laughs> car was already stolen when I stole it. I swear. <laughs> I can't tell if I want to keep it in noir mode or switch it back to color because I think switching it to color cheapens it somehow. But that's because I really like black and white photography, so maybe that's why. <laughs> um. Yeah, I think it's better black and white. Yeah. L.A. Noir put out a black and white mode, I think. And, uh... Dishonored 2 has a black and white mode. That's excellent. The <clears throat> Demon Souls remake for PS5 has a shit ton of visual filters. Oh, yeah. Really cool. That game is so pretty. I still play oh, yeah. it. It's like one of, one of the prettiest games on the PS5 still. Mm-hmm. Blue Point is... Blue God. Point Master Race. I don't know what they're doing over yeah. there, but they're doing it right. I, I'm thinking they're rem Didn't they announce actually they're remaking Metal Gear Solid or something? Or am I uh, Snake Eater Delta or something? Oh, yeah, they're no, yeah, they're remaking. Uh, I don't think it's Blue Point, but I know they're remaking MGS3. Yeah, which is exciting. Snake Eater remake. It's called Snake Eater Delta. <laughs> I'm sorry, Snake Eater Triangle. <laughs> which is why I was playing the other two Metal Gears. I wanted to play all the Metal Gears to get ready for Delta, and then it turns out I don't like Metal Gear, so... <laughs> At least I don't like playing them. I'll, 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 it's fine watching them, but I don't like playing them. Have you played MGS5? Uh, like, maybe two hours of it. Yeah, yeah. I, that's all I could handle, too. It's so bad. I don't understand why yeah. people love it so much. I, yeah. And two hours, half of that is a cut. Actually, most of that's a cut scene. Yeah, I, two hours was conservative gameplay time. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. So I think two hours gameplay translates to about 12 hours. <laughs> Which is fine. It's kind of Kojima's thing, but, yeah. like, 
Too. Holy shit, at least make a coherent make story. Mm -hmm. The whole story in that game is like, oh, yeah, so it's the like 80s. That. Things are really cool, but, but we're killing people in Afghanistan. <laughs> fuck the Russians, but then also there's a bunch of mantises that are out here trying to kill you. It's like, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> this is so stupid. There's, when I was just playing MGS2 before I quit, there's a place where you're like in the engine compartment of a ship and you have to shoot. There's like this hallway of lasers and if you trip the lasers it explodes a bunch of Semtex and you die. But next to each Semtex is a little control panel that you have to shoot to disable the lasers. But they made it a puzzle as to how you're supposed to shoot them and they give you the tiniest tiniest frame to actually hit the thing <laughs> but you're shooting on a ps2 with yeah. no reticle like and trying to aim and yes an evil one or something exactly <laughs> and it's not only does it tell you that you don't it doesn't tell you that you have to stand on your tippy toes which you do which is a feature i didn't even know existed in the game until i looked it up because i couldn't figure out what i was supposed to do but then also like it it, it took me 40 minutes to shoot that one panel i'm dying over and over and over again yeah. it sucked and then by the time i did that i was like there i did it i'm never playing this game again <laughs> Ooh. Quick quest uh, question. Uh, what color do you think the car is now? I'm gonna say red. Uh, hold on. Let's see. Oh. Jesus. Yeah, that's red. That's either red or like a purple. Uh. But I'm thinking, yeah, like a cherry. Red. <laughs> or I was gonna say orange. You know what? I'm gonna I'm keep that in color for this minute. Ah, oh, it's so weird to look at. Vibrant. Yeah, that's why I don't I like care that. for it. <laughs> That's not like what the world was like back then. Yeah. <laughs> the world was fucking black and white. Come on. Whoa! <laughs> Nearly killed that guy. Also, why is this in the game? I don't know. Ever since I started talking to you, I haven't been paying attention to the game. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta take out Morello. Don Morello. <laughs> His son's daughter's wife's child's dog's boyfriend is gonna be racing tomorrow. Where in Chicago do they have a racetrack this size? Where in Chicago? look even remotely like this. This is fucking Forza. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh my god, I thought I lost all my... I almost said legs, but I mean tires. My legs! <laughs> oh my, that tire looked like it was about to come off, and now it's fine. It's just every time you turn, it looks like it's... Whoa! Going to <laughs> I didn't think that would happen. <laughs> oh, 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 why did it stop you? Oh, you're fine. This race is far from over indeed. <laughs> Top yeah, hole pretzels? Is that what that sign just said? I did not see it, but that wouldn't surprise me. You know how Chicago is with their pretzels yeah. and their mountain. <laughs> their one mountain. <laughs> their this little rocky mountain pass. Oh yeah, I see the pretzels. Whoa! This is what? insane. Why are we skating? What is that? What is that ink? This is like that uh freaking Mario Odyssey level where you gotta bounce as the Yeti. <laughs> Fuck, I wanna play Mario Odyssey. <laughs> that game is so good. What do I actually wanna play? Part of me wants to play Bashi. Wah! Oh, I forgot about Bashi. <laughs> we haven't been in a call the other in so long. <laughs> Made me think of it. I mean, I'm not gonna <laughs> coerce you to do anything, but if you Bashi, I'm gonna just join in. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't. It. I can't. Does There's it save no your progress? Because it looks like yeah. a flash game, so how does it do that? Yeah, yeah, it, it, it has save states <laughs> okay. in the game. Luckily, it's an actual application and not <laughs> not a, a Shockwave Java app. <clears throat> I miss Shockwave. That was the good shit. Do they even still have fucking Java? No, no you can't make Java like flash games anymore. It's I mean, a... you can, but like, yeah. I wouldn't be able to run it. Why the hay just disappears? <laughs> You hit it so hard that uh, it disintegrated. You obliterated the hadrons themselves. Oh god! Oh, that that guy did the jump. jump! How come that guy can do the jump but I can't? You didn't. No, you made it furthest. <laughs> yeah, but I'm upside down. Where's my head? Am I underground? How do I flip over? Oh, flip overs hold down this. Yeah, my head was clipping into the ground. <laughs> 
him. It's it's crazy how nobody gets hurt back in the day, you know. Especially Driving. considering these cars cars are made of plywood. <laughs> They're made of plywood, and you literally, if you flip over, they, they're literally crafted in such a way that it's so easy to fucking flip over, and if you do, you just get crushed. I, I miss these days. I don't <laughs> need regulations. Give me a, just, just put me in one of these today on the highway. Let's play fun. football where our helmets are a quarter inch of leather. <laughs> yeah. Super Bowl, is, Super Bowl, this is, is your chance to do the funniest thing you could do. <laughs> Oh, come on with the fucking... They could just, like, spray paint Leatherhead shit yeah. onto their helmet. It would be I don't... Whoa! <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but apparently it's a big deal that Nickelodeon, for some reason, is hosting the football... The the, the, the Super Bowl this year. What? How does that work? I don't know. What does that mean? I what just keep seeing mean? things on TikTok saying Super Bowl is being hosted by Nickelodeon. Oh, those guys just died for no reason. Oh, so do these guys! <laughs> no, you are! Oh, that's what we need. Jurassic Park Racers. <laughs> Jurassic Park Racers. I called a fucking ball. <laughs> Have you... I don't know if you're on TikTok or anything. <clears throat> but... Uh... <clears throat> Have you seen in all of your life that there's this guy who's making a dinosaur fighting game where the dinosaurs have like giant swords in their mouths and stuff? Oh yeah, I've seen that. It looks really cool. Yeah, I'm really interested. I don't know if this is one of those games, but I just imagine it is because that, that sounds so silly. Um, I'm really into the games that are like. 100% physics based, so they don't actually have like animations beyond just like making the oh, actual. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what's the word? I don't know. The assets like actually move. The um, script. There's this one. Yeah. Like I, I want individual control. Like kind of honestly, kind of like um, gang beast or party animals yeah. in a sense, except less cartoony, I guess. Of course, there's I lost the race. Did you see how many times I crashed? <laughs> fair play. That's fair. Can't tell them not. Oh, I have uh, to win? <clears throat> yeah, sorry. Oh, man, I gotta pee before I win. But carry on. <laughs> uh, there's this game called X Anima. I don't know if you've heard of that. But it it's sounds early access. And it's been in early access for like five years, but it looks really cool. It's like a uh, top-down dungeon crawler, but it's like physics-based. Hmm. I really want to play it. Sounds familiar. But what sounds more familiar right now is that I'm gonna pee. It's pee. <laughs> Bye. I'll be right back. My, where's my shoe? Give it to me. I have clinical depression. So I get that I have to win the race and stuff, but like at the end there, in the final stretch, 
uh like i was in seventh out of 16th place and then like nine people just passed me with no qualms <laughs> like it's a, it's a scripted loss don't worry yeah yeah it's a scripted loss that makes me need to restart <laughs> okay this game is even cooler than i thought I, i'm watching a hell it's like a not really a trailer. No, uh, the one I was just talking oh, about, okay. Xanima. Um, I'm watching some gameplay, and this dude just picked up a crate and just, like, threw it on some dude's head, and it, like, confused him and, like, made him follow. <laughs> That's my kind of shit. You know why I died? It's because I was in color mode. There we go. I wish I could adjust the black and white though. I wish I could add more contrast. Alright, this time I won't crash a single time. That guy already is out. <laughs> it's a long three laps though. That was not very nice. Okay, so the thing is... The controls for driving are weird, because it says... It says LT to brake, which is standard, but LT doesn't apply more braking force than just letting go of the gas. Oh. And also, A is to ram other cars, but if I hit A to turn, it acts as a handbrake, and so it's easier to turn. It doesn't make any sense. I bet if I put a speed limiter on. <laughs> yeah, see, there I just hit the brakes and it didn't do anything for me. Yeah, I gotta hit ram the ram button to drift. Otherwise, the turn radius is horrible and I just keep going straight. There we go. Look at this drift. Sick. Siak. This race is far from over. We're on the first lap. Oh my god, speak of the devil, 70% off Rockstar Games. <laughs> I don't care. How much are they selling the uh, Definitive Trilogy for? Oh my god, I just did a kickflip. <laughs> Thirty dollars. Wow. Yeah. Better than sixty. <laughs> sure is. Yeah, I'm sure it's worth it. I remember when that came out and people were just like, "What the fuck is this?" Yeah, and you couldn't access any Rockstar game for like three days while they were messing with the launcher. Yeah. Thank you. GTA Five still has money. that memory leak, even though they paid that guy all that money to fix the memory leak. <laughs> <laughs> Get scammed. You know what? I'll buy Manhunt. I've never played that. From like 96 or something? <laughs> it's from 2004, but it's a Rockstar game, so. Is it Rockstar? I thought it was. Mm -hmm. okay, okay. Well, what about Manhunt 2? Is that also Rockstar? Uh, I would hope so, but maybe not, because I don't see it here. I remember seeing a video oh, yeah. on Manhunt, one of them. I think he's starting like a prison or something. But isn't it like you get yeah. alien powers or something? Or you're a serial killer or something. <laughs> I forget. It's been I, years. I, you might be thinking of the darkness where you get alien No, <laughs> I, I do remember the darkness, but I'm not thinking of that. <laughs> what the fuck are we about hell divers? God damn it. Don't give in. I'm not. It, uh, it no, don't give in. <laughs> No, 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 I'm not. It has bad reviews. People are saying the multiplayer doesn't work, and it has kernel level uh, anti cheat. I'm not. I'm not doing any of that. Okay. Uh, oh god, another kickflip. Oh, same what a barrel roll. Same. Uh, come on, flip, 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 flip. I'm holding the button. Flip. No, don't see me. See me in first place. <laughs> Jason! 
Jesus. This is a long three lap race. It's like five minutes. Shit. Holy shaft! My guy did not like that. I certainly hope so, otherwise it would be very annoying. Okay, this does- oh! This might be beneficial. <laughs> Recently, I read through Ayn Rand's uh, Atlas Shrugged. What do you think? <laughs> uh, I think Ayn Rand was a... I think Ayn Rand was a person who did not understand the degree... Of why capitalism was bad. Of... <laughs> Is bad. <laughs> well, I... yes, but I wasn't even going to extend it that far. <laughs> to her, it's basically like a pipe dream. Like, it was just her... <laughs> trying to manifest it in some way to being whatever she wanted it to be but beyond that she was she just didn't understand like how the systems that were in place in the soviet union were not the fault of quote unquote communism or socialism it was it was the, the way that the government was set up in a totalitarian way yeah it's easier to just be red pilled literally <laughs> Do you see that new game by the people who made Bioshock? I forget what it's called. Yes, it looks really cool. Yeah. I have it on my wish list. Uh, it is called Judas or something. Judas. Yes. Yeah. I also have Pony Island Two Panda Circus. <laughs> How does that compare to? Uh... Teddy, Teddy, what's it called? Oh, oh, Pony Island 2 is a psychological horror game. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's not one of those games that they jokingly put psychological horror as the tag, but it actually is. It's, um, what's the guy's name? I don't know if you know the guy, but he makes Daniel Mullins. He's the one that made, uh, Pony Island 1, obviously, he made, uh, Inscription. Oh, that guy, okay. God, that guy's popping off. He, he makes crazy ass games, yeah. For a single player dev, he put out three bangers in like five yeah. years? Well, That's insane. <laughs> well, he. From like 10, 15 years ago at this point. Yeah, but then he put out Inscription, which everybody yeah, which I've heard like played loved. Ago. God, it's so awesome. I love Inscription. I don't like card games, but that's one that I don't either. Wants I hate me to play it. Just, yeah, it, it's the one, that was the one reason I didn't play it sooner. I was like, card games are lame, but it's not a card game. Trust me. Okay. Yeah, it, it is. It is an experience. Fine, Polly. This isn't Polly, but it is bad frame rate. Oh. Yeah, Judas looks really cool though. I love a good Bioshock. Judas. Vincenzo. It makes me want to play uh, Prey again. Yeah, me too. To me, Prey was like a space Bioshock. Oh yeah, that that's they're all shock games. <laughs> shock type games. Yeah. Bio. Yeah, you play Prey, and I'll I'll put, I'll, put, I'll glue my eyeballs to your eyeballs so I can watch it. <laughs> Magic you gotta glue them to the back of my eyeball. Just <laughs> or just connect them directly into my brain. Prey 2017 is one of my all time favorites. Oh, yeah. It's really awesome. Should I? <sighs> no, I, I can't start a game right now. It's just too much to focus on. If you feel you have to switch to Helldivers, that's fine with me. <laughs> I'm not buying it. It's too expensive. <laughs> And all the other reasons. Butcher sausage and ice cold lemonade. <laughs> Hot dog butcher. Ooh, you know what I can do. <laughs> Great race, champ. Thank you, whomever. Hey, last time I saw you drive like that, Tom, I had a gun to your head. You saying there wasn't one today? <laughs> when our side of town is drowning in dough, that means you're safe. Hey, who's in Polly? Guys, south. Soused. Yeah, Soused. 
Oh, here we go. Entertainment City. You crashed. Pardon me, I have to alt tab to come over here. Yeah, don't worry, it crashed. Give uh, it a couple seconds. Okay, I was gonna say there's no live button. <laughs> it might crash. It crashed. Ha! <laughs> okay, it's not. Uh, that's not happening. So we're gonna try. <laughs> what was it? Uh, Dark Souls Three. I was, oh. I was playing um, the Convergence mod, which is really oh. Cool. But I also have some other Elden Ring mod installed, so I guess I'll play that. Nice. I've been watching someone I like play Elden Ring, but I know their series is finite and they didn't finish it, so oh. I just stopped watching it. That's ominous. Well, it's he's I don't know if you've ever heard of him. His channel name is Plague of Gripes. Uh no. he does like these very analytical playthroughs and stuff and uh oh, oh he, like analytical in the sense of like reading all the items and shit and like trying to figure out yeah that's that's you know, the story that's yeah cool. but uh he doesn't like he, he pretty much only likes dark souls one all the other ones he's like Ugh, they keep making it too fast and too hard and too stupid and i agree with him on many 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 points but also bloodborne yeah. is too good <laughs> Uh, Bloodborne is fucking interesting. Yeah. Hello. Especially the story. Oh my god. Hello. Do I don't have Megan muted. Why is she so low? Is she's muted? Oh. For you. That's fair. <laughs> there you go. No, she's like sixty percent. Megan, speak the speech. I pray thee as it comes trippingly off the tongue. Yeehaw. Thank you. <laughs> Pledge allegiance to the hall of the yeast. Of the yeast. <laughs> of the yeast. <laughs> I was trying to say the United States of America, but yeast came out. Oh god, you're going for millennia? Yeah. Sounds about right. I think I'm gonna finish this chapter and then be done for tonight. I've been playing for like three hours. Or he's a quitter. Two hours. What? It's been hours. He's a quitter. <laughs> He's quitting. Oh god, ten dime detective. Ah, fuck that move is so. Hmm. Why the hell is this Paul? Have you ever killed her before? Oh yeah, many many times. Okay, oh, brag. Yeah, Jesus. <laughs> many many times. It's, uh, it's because I've played this game like eight hundred times. Insane. Hey, this is the. uh song from fucking Sea of Thieves. Oh, I know what you're talking about. That was a 1920s classic. <laughs> that was on the Billboard Top 10, because there were only 10 songs in total. Trigger not if you're lubricating. Champion's choice. You can do that shit. Cow does say moon. You got that right, Polly. Wink. Wink. Blonk. Hello. How's everyone doing? Am I right? You're looking at it. Tomorrow I meet with the other surgeon. Nice. What did the first one say? Uh. He confirmed that it was a lipoma and said, I don't do that, so... Oh. <laughs> but it is benign, right? Uh, yeah, but oh, that's he, he said, normally they don't huh. get this big, and then he said, uh, the bigger they are, the more likely it is to fall? turn, uh, <laughs> and the more likely it is to turn into something malignant, so oh, no. please hurry and get it removed. Day, yeah. yeah, I'm surprised you've kept it so long. <laughs> it it <laughs> like a baby. Uh, yeah. It didn't bother me. Uh, I figured. I mean, it's just like ugly, whatever. But like, I don't really give a shit. And then uh, it started hurting, and I was like, yeah, Oh no. yeah, that's when you were like, yeah, that's bad. It 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 grew too big, and it it started getting on my nerves. So. It like hurt the skin because it was too tight, or it hurt the insides. I hurt the inside. Oh, it's that's bad. Like growing like against the nerve or something. Oh, so, um, yeah. If I like press on it, or if I um, 
Like if I look, try to lay on my right side now, like on I mean, my arm yeah. or anything, like my hand, get, it feels like since you the family, if I press on it for like just a couple, right? like a minute, it feels like my arm is going to sleep. Oh my god. Well, I'm sorry for your loss, and I hope you get that taken care of very soon. Yeah, I mean they they got me in within a week, so like That's they must cool. agree that it's necessary. Um, and so I had a coworker who had one, and hers was about this big, and I, I guess they tried to, like, take it out or something, and, um, they said that they said, um, it was attached to, like, muscle or something, and so, um, they couldn't just, like, they, they had to put her under for it, and so I'm expecting that to happen with me as well. Well, actually, I, I don't know why they don't put everybody under for surgery. I don't know. I don't uh, know. I mean, <laughs> yeah, that's no excuse. It's a lot of liability. <laughs> <laughs> they put me under when I have my appendix taken out. That's, I would hope so. <laughs> yeah, that's different. If they don't have to put me under, I don't want it. I would much rather just be, be numb. Yeah, if it were something... That was like fine, and they let me watch them do it. That would be cool. Um, they probably absolutely would not let you watch no. it because they don't want you to like pass out. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I finally completed the chapter. Okay, you say that, but one time I had like a, an infection in my toe, and they were like, "Hey, watch this," and then they fucking <laughs> pulled that shit out. <laughs> watch me do this. They pulled out some like. <laughs> Yeah, they legit, I was like...